Only on RTV6, we are learning new details about the Lafayette couple who killed two police officers and an innocent bystander in Las Vegas. Today, Nevada police revealed that they talked to Jared and Amanda Miller three separate times this year, including a threatening over the phone encounter against the Indiana BMV. And tonight we have obtained a copy of his conversation with the agency. It's a call from Jared Miller in Nevada to the Indiana BMV, and it's laced with profanities. I'm really sick and tired of all these laws and regulations. It's absolutely insane. As a person of the DMV, can you tell me how many laws are on the books concerning drivers? The recorded seven-minute call was made on January 21st, six months before Jared and his wife went on a deadly shooting rampage in Nevada, killing two police officers having lunch and shooting a shopper at a Walmart. Investigators believe the anti-police and anti-government attitudes of the Millers fueled the shooting. When Jarrett made that call to the Indiana BMV back in January, Nevada police had taken his license and given him a ticket for $525. His license had been suspended in Indiana for failure to prove he had insurance during two vehicle incidents. Outraged over the issue, Jarrett threatened to shoot people. Indiana's the whole court system's messed up. It's not my fault and that he needs to drop the case. And if he doesn't, I'm going to be forwarding this bill to you guys. And if they come to arrest me for noncompliance or whatever, I'm just going to start shooting people. BMV's Fraud and Security Enforcement Division contacted Nevada authorities after the call, giving them details about Miller's driving record and the entire recorded exchange. We're also told the BMV was notified and told the threat was looked into and the investigation was concluded. Mm -hmm.